Halloween is almost here and this morning we're checking out fun, affordable and safe ways to celebrate Halloween with the help from a talented Fox 61 mom. Now Keith McGilvery and Margot Farrell are spending the morning in Audrey Kuchin's backyard where she is teaching them some creative ways to get festive as they've had a uh, competition and I want to see who's won. <laughs> Who's won, Tim Lambert? I know you gave Keith the benefit of the doubt. I'm taking my glasses off because I can't see anything, but I think I still won. This is what I used, okay? This was my demo, right? And now, I mean, did I perfectly execute that or what? Free-handed it, and Keith, what did you do? The competition is still continuing, but the <laughs> woman of the hour, Audrey Kuchin, you are a rock star. You are like the craftiest member of our team. We're going to talk three costumes that you can put together. You say pretty easily. Yeah, hi, my friends. It's so good to see you. Good morning. Um, I loved the call I got from you yesterday. It was like three costumes for all three of my babies, balling on a budget. We hit the dollar store hard. We spent 15 bucks. So that means that each of these costumes is $5 or less. Let me walk you through it. Yeah, let's get okay. started. Okay, so um, Piper, my three-year-old, wants to be a flower pot. So we bought this little um, you know, bucket, cut out the bottom of it, and then just went ahead yeah. and um, cut out some grass with some construction paper and duct tape on all the flowers around it and then used a pack of headbands, a six pack of headbands for the little uh, way to strap it onto her when she's trick or treating. That's and that was like cute. literally just like three right minutes took us. Keith, you can't fit in this one, so we won't do yeah, a demo. We'll try that. Meanwhile, Dolly is just beautiful here. Does Dolly have a costume? Is one of these for Dolly? Yes, little okay. baby doll, same idea, cut out the bottom, right? And then um, she is going to be a little gumball machine and oh we just um, glued on all these with craft glue onto a little, she's Very stoked exciting. about it, um, onto a little hat from the dollar store. This one cost us $3, you guys. And by the way, this was all really fun to do with the kids. Like they were into it. It wasn't like I was a mom taking over. Like they were yeah. doing the hard Easy work. Easy for them to do, okay? Finally, and then Johnny. Johnny's is my favorite. So yeah. let's, let's talk about this. <laughs> He's super fired up about this one. I'm sure if your kids are like mine, they love the Ninja Turtles. So we finger painted the heck out of this lasagna tray dollar at the dollar store um, strapped on some headbands so he can put it around his little arms and then bought two headbands one to wrap around the head one around the wrist and I don't remember what the purple turtle ninja ninja turtle was but you know, the, you, know the gist, you know the gist of what he did <laughs> yeah. I love these and so under $15 super easy to do and even I mean pumpkin carving is an old school tradition that that's something you can do we said earlier they have tons of free prints online so you can help get yes you can help get guided yes that's right yeah it's a good idea like just everybody wants to do everything on a budget and also something they can do as a family so we had a really good time doing it and the other thing I do every year is just buy pajamas because I feel like that's a good way like they can sleep in them and they can be a costume <laughs> Audrey Kuchin is a rock star she is joining us in our next hour with a family friendly charcuterie board you and your husband are keeping these kids rocking and rolling through this pandemic you're finding a way to make it work listen we're doing the best we can and we're really enjoying the family time together so good to see you guys yeah, it's like we, not we, hold on before <laughs> before we sign off girlfriend give me a high five if I won hey yo that was a high five I won the pumpkin contest thank you Dolly Margo didn't listen to the rules the the winner will be revealed. Piper and Johnny, uh, Audrey's kids, are picking the winner at 10 a.m. But we have, we, we have a we progress have a poll underway. Showing us where we stand. <laughs> All right. So, so much more fun coming up on the Box 61 Morning News as we continue with more Halloween ideas. Again, to keep you safe, happy, and having fun. In just a couple of days, Halloween three days away. All right. I'm yeah, Keith Gilbrey yeah, with buddy. Audrey and Dolly. First Halloween. Box 61 News. <laughs> All right. We have to get back to work. I already won.